Now, did I miss something? Because I always tend to miss things in this section of the game for some reason. I need to have a look-see, look about. A look about. Well, there it is. That's what I missed. Uh, no, wait. I'm actually going to get to that later, I think. I think that's something that we'll eventually get to. Right? I always seem to miss things in this section of the map, and I hate missing things. Uh, I think there's definitely items there that you can go and get that I don't remember how to. Stone Fang. Psh, the amount of time I've spent in Stone Fang. Let's see. Are there items in there? I think I might have already have been there, though. Haven't I? Have I been here yet? Not sure, because everything's intact, and I tend to break everything that I go through. Uh, oh, look at that. The water thing. Uh, uh huh. Nope, I'm lost. I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going. I guess I can just go down here and go from here. And from here we can proceed onward with the level. Uh-oh. Oh. For a second there, I thought I threw myself into a cell. Now we can also take a quick little shower here. Ah. Nice and hot. <laughs> oh, we got a couple of corpses here. Some half-moon grass. Some more shards. Stone Fang Tunnel is definitely one of the biggest places to farm for the early game shards. Oh yeah, I have been here. Well, I guess the only thing that's left is go up. Go up through here. And I think that this will take us to the places that I haven't been to yet. And eventually to the big armor spider demon. Ooh. I'm so scared. What, you guys don't have sarcasm anymore? Come on, you guys. You guys gotta know that line. You guys just have to know that line. If you do not know that reference, that's, it's just bad. As a matter of fact, speaking of which, I need to go and get that movie again. I haven't seen that movie in quite some time, and I really like it. Come on, dude, blow this thing to smithereens. As a matter of fact, oops. Looks like I hadn't done Second Chance yet. Interesting. Come on, blow this thing to smithereens, motherfucker. What you got? What you got? What you got? What you got? You ain't got shit. Get sliced up like a bitch. I wasn't even looking at you while I was killing you, because cool guys don't look at explosions or scumbags while they're chopping them up. There's an item in here, isn't there? Nope. I guess not. I can just roll all over the place. Roll like balls. Okay, we're looking good. We are looking pretty damn solid. Solid, Skipper! There's the items that I was looking at. Son of ephemeral eyes. Thank you. That will come quite in handy when I decide to blacken the world tendency. Which I will at some point. At some point, I'm going to be forced to blacken the crap out of the tendency of this place. Oh, they're throwing rocks at me? Oh, no. It's just this dude. Goodbye. Excuse me. I'm sorry. It was a drive-by, uh... Drive-by stab to the chest with Makoto. Because Makoto does not fool around. It's just the way these things are. Now here we also have uh, another interesting item. That if I remember at some point I even wanted to make a, a build around this item. Didn't I? Isn't this like a pretty decent item for Dex or something? The Chris Blade? I think it's a pretty good item if you actually get it upgraded and whatnot. Or I could be totally wrong. But I seem to remember at some point wanting to make a, a build about that particular item. Let's go ahead and turn this blade. How's our stats, by the way? 20 strength and 14 dexterity. Yeah, I was wondering if I would have to do a big investment to use the white bow. Because I kind of dig the white bow, but I guess I, I would have to do a pretty damn big investment to go ahead and do that. So, yeah. Yeah. Oh, look, there's an item over here, and then there's a boss across the room. I wonder how much hits from Makoto will the spider take, if I can even take on the spider, because this spider is actually... She's no cakewalk, that's for damn sure. 
Good old armor spider. Whoa, dude. No, not cool. Oh, snap. Stop that. Anything else you'd care to send over? Or are you done? Damn it. I forgot that I need to block those three times. Okay, that's good. Not looking for that. Come on. Come here. Holy hell. Okay, I need to... Thank you. Oh, this is the blast, right? No? Oh no, this is just a part where I can do three hits, and I totally messed it up. Damn you. Oh, three hits, three hits, three hits, three hits, and three hits! And now is the big AoE explosion. Damn it. I actually should have kept blocking. Damn, I'm so slow. Look at how slow I am because of you. Stupid spider. This spider is serious business once you've leveled up. Serious, serious business. Yay, you revived, you regained your body and all those other things. And to be completely honest, what I'm going to do with my body is basically I'm going to go ahead and kill myself. Because I'm, I'm just not feeling it today, guys. I'm just not feeling it, so I'm going to go back to the Nexus and I'm going to go kill myself. Now, in all honesty, you kind of got to do that because I do not want to touch the, the world tendency. I want to keep this bad boy in pure white. Is it even in pure white? I don't think it's pure white just yet. I think it could go one more into whiteness. So let's go back to the Nexus. I'm even considering doing the shortcut for this particular level because the rest of the level is just so damn boring. Oh, hello. How are you doing? Are you feeling okay? Touch the demon inside me. Key to life's ether. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. May thine strength help the world be mended. I wonder if she saw me kill those people in, in Nexus the other day. She was like, oh my god. This dude's like going all the way dark side on this bitch. Now let's go ahead and kill ourselves. Do, 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 do. What the hell is that? Why is there a blue shining thing there? Am I missing something? What the hell is that thing? I gotta go check that out. Although, there's something here that I also want to check out. There seems to be an item there. Oh, how interesting. I've never gone through here to try and get that item. Doot. Doot. Uh, still this way. And almost likely this way. Uh, no, I messed it up. Didn't I? I think I'm... Oh, no, wait. There's a, a landing platform there. I've never picked up this particular soul before. And now can I throw off of here and kill myself? No, I doubt it. Because that wouldn't make a lot of sense now, would it? How about if instead I just try to jump master? Yeah! Jump master like a boss and go back up. And then kill myself. <laughs> I sound like a crazy person. Wait a second. I am a crazy person. Now let's see. Is it this way? To go to the place where I go and I kill myself? I'm just curious because I saw some kind of blue light and I was curious to check that out again. Aha! There it is. Oh, I know what that is. That's Sage Frake. Yo, Frake! I want to see your lap! <laughs> want to see your lap! Okay, now that we've done that, uh, we shall proceed through level two, where we will most likely meet up with Patches again. Patches the scumbag. Well, actually, Patches is already here, which is interesting. So he shows up in that level again. Man, I really haven't played Demon Souls in a long-ass time, but 
Let's figure. Oh wait, 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 wait. Where's my five thousand souls? Hmm? Hmm? Patches is trying to keep my souls. That's what he's trying to do. The scumbag. Goddamn patches. Can't trust him. You just can't trust him. That's the thing. You cannot ever, under any circumstance, trust patches. Just don't do it. Just don't even try. Here's my souls. I need my souls. My soul power. I'm wondering if I should do the whole shortcut to the... What's his name again? Oh, wait. Before I do anything. I can forge weapons for you. How about you? Holy crap. 500, huh? That's pretty expensive. Makoto is an expensive sword to repair. You come back alive. I need your business. I bet you need my business, you scumbag. Now then, move onward. Uh, armor, spider, archstone. Oh my god, I have an itchy nose today for some reason. Jesus, it is killing me. Okay. Oh man, I really didn't want to miss out on that particular little fellow that you guys see up ahead, so I need to rush this mode. Rush this beast mode! Stop running. Stop running. Damn it. I knew you guys would come after me, but I killed it. <laughs> Hello. Now you need to chill. You need to just go ahead and chill. As well as you, sir. How the hell did he hit me? Not even close, dude. Cheating bastard. Oh, look at that. Yellow exploding things. Why don't you ask that guy how he felt about that? He didn't feel too good. It was like a terrorist drive-by. Terrorist drive-by. They're like your local gangsters. From another continent. That was terrible. That was just a bad, bad joke. But hey, it's YouTube's comedy week, so... I don't know, maybe bad jokes are acceptable. Stab this fool. Stab this fool. Whoa. You dudes need to chill. Tell that bitch to chill. Say, bitch, be cool. Thank you. Now, if you'll excuse me, good sir. I'm going to go have to stab you right there in between the ribs. I know it's kind of uh, uncomfortable and stuff, but sometimes these kinds of things just need to happen. Now, I don't want to do the shortcut, so we'll just take the long route. Although the shortcut has a lot of stuff, so... What? Dude! 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 Seriously. Highly, highly inappropriate. I'm trying to run a family show, for God's sake. Jesus Christ. It's hard enough not to cuss, and then these guys pull this kind of stunt on me. Porn on Murakan show? Come on. And we got another one of these dudes, these exploding damn... Oh, yeah, th crap, I, I actually need to run away from this one. I think the thing doesn't stop, does it? Does it stay in one spot while it explodes? Oh, actually, it does. Actually, it does stay in one spot while it explodes. That is mighty convenient, good sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. Isn't there an elevator now that goes down and stuff? Yeah, there is. Hello. What are you doing here? What are you doing? Hmm? Who are you? What are you doing here? Why are you hiding back here? I am not sure how I feel about this. Algeite of Guidance. Monster pieces! There's monster pieces everywhere. Hello? No? Get stabbed! Rurikon here, coming through. Out of my face. Where the hell are we? And we're down in the mine. Oh, wait, is that... That's a lizard. That's a gecko. You son of a bitch! Don't you run away from me. Stop it. And die. Thank you. 
I never even see what kind of shards I'm picking up, but I'm pretty sure they're going to be useful if I plan on doing the whole weapon grind thing, which is a pain in the ass. But I'm going to try to do it regardless. That's just a fact. It's something that I need to see completed. Dude, 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 dude. No, 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 no. Just, just not cool. Not cool. Trying to jump scare me? Not cool at all. Just running around two-handing the Makoto sword like a goddamn samurai. Is this the way down? No, this is just to get these particular items. Oh, so this is just like a little uh, bonus zone? Interesting. I never remember how, how the levels actually pan out in here apart from a couple of Boletarian ones because the Boletarian levels are actually the ones that I really like. The ones where you're like in a castle and stuff. I dig those levels. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to survive that fall, so the hell with all that. We'll just take the elevator down from this point onward. I've already gotten all the items here. Is there anything else in here? Ooh. Look at that huge-ass bug. And there's Patches down there. See Patches waving at us? <laughs> Good old Patches. Such a nice guy. If it wasn't for the fact that he's a goddamn scumbag, but... Apart from that, he's actually a pretty nice guy. But now, let's keep on going. And we're going deeper on the ground. We're going... There's too much panic in this town. Someone actually asked me once in one of my videos if this was a... Uh, if this was actually a music. Uh, what, what I have to say to that is that I know. I'm getting really, really old. Damn it! Stop running! That's a good boy. And something is running towards me. What the crap is this? Okay. Um. I don't think I've ever been here before. Because I've never fought these guys before. What the frack? Get me the hell out of here. Oh sweet, one of them came with me. Kick him off the platform. Die! I had never seen these black invaders. Ever. I had never seen these guys. I was scared shitless. I mean, seriously, there's actually places in Demon Souls that I've never seen before? What the frack is going on here? Holy hell, where's the other guy? Where is the other guy? Is it because this world is in pure white? Or what the hell is going on? And one of them's missing. I wonder if he went back to his spawn point or did he kill himself? Oh, he might have killed himself. Because maybe when you activate this... Wait a second, is there a second lever? Yeah, there is. So let's find out. Oh, wow. He killed himself. I'm pretty sure he jumped down there. But, I mean, there was two of them. What the hell? I might have, nev I'm ne I might have never came to this tunnel to begin with. Well, that gecko's gone. Oh, wait. I know this tunnel. Look at the amount of geckos in here. What the frack is this? Are you kidding me? Attack, attack, attack! What the hell is it with this tunnel? This is like gecko farmland or something. I don't think I've ever been here before. Wow. I'm sorry guys, it's just I get really surprised when I find something in a Souls game that I had never seen before. And this was definitely the case. I am still surprised, but I this looks like the shortcut that goes to... Um, it looks like the shortcut that goes to Flame Lurker, but it's not. No, it's not. It's just this 
tunnel with two black phantoms in here for some reason. Well, it's a good thing that I separated them through the use of the elevator, because holy crap. That would have been a full-on slaughter. Interestingly enough, I don't think I got souls for killing the other guy. Maybe I did. I'll have to look at the, the replay when I'm editing. Try and figure out what the hell ever happened to the other guy. Wait, have I gone down this tunnel? I might have. No, I haven't. Holy crap. Um... Okay. But I think I've been on this particular tunnel before, though. I'm just trying to attract these things, but... It doesn't look like they're actually biting, so... I have to keep on moving. Problem here is that you'll confuse these torches with the lights that are bad for you. Like this. Bong! Well, it's not like I actually confused it, but... Let's trade this. Well, I actually have more full moon grass. Well, let's keep the half moon grass here. And just put full moon grass there. There. And for now, stick to late. And slowly chug along through the level. Hello! Damn it. Hi. Oops. Chop. And there's another pathway here. And those things will explode, so you gotta be real careful about it. Is there anything actually down there? No. And what's the reason for those things being there? Some of these levels are just plain weird, but let's keep going this way. Basically, we're exploring the underground area first, and then we'll go through the shortcuts and whatnot. Oh, wait, this... Yeah, this actually goes to the underground area. Okay. Although, there's still quite a lot to explore. Hello. You cute little thing. Such a cute little thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Can I stab you? Oh crap, I don't do any damage. So we do have to two-hand in order to get these dudes. Well, let's... Out of stamina. Come on. Slice those mofos. It doesn't seem like they actually drop anything. They probably get... Um, give you a chunk of damage on the weapon, though. Oh, crap. These are the big ones. Okay, not good, not good. So... How the hell am I going to kill this thing? It's got, like, infinite poise. And it doesn't seem to bleed. And the small one's coming after me, too. Hello. Oops, missed. One more hit. Thank you. Oh, damn it! I keep forgetting to do second chance, so it's a good thing that I always mess up when I pull out the bow. Jesus Christ, 16 damage at a time? That's gonna take a while. I need something that does a ton of damage, and this is not doing it. Oops. I want to use a grass right about now. Come on, come on, what you got, what you got? Come on, you got the leg work? You don't got the leg work. You just got lots of legs. No leg work. Look at that charge. Oh crap, I'm stuck. Ooh, scared me. And we gotta hit him. Just a couple more times, because then he's gonna explode. Boosh! Look at that explosion. That's massive. That is massive indeed. So what do we have here? Shard of Dragonstone. And the hell with that. Wait, is there a way to fall down, to safely fall down through here? It almost seems like it, but I'm pretty sure that it's not safe. And I really don't want to find out at this point. Because you guys remember the last time I was like, Oh man, I wonder if it's safe to fall down through there. Oh, no. I 
knew it would happen. I knew it. Ah, Ring of Herculean Strength. There goes all my health. And for an axe. Yeah. Especially right before Flame Lurker, you do not want to be like this. But I guess we'll explore the rest of the level. Hello. You think... What the hell? I killed the first ones with one swing. The hell's wrong with this one? Okay, I'm screwed. And let's go back to Half Moon Grass. Yeah, that should do it. Look at how annoying you are, you stupid little tentacle. God damn it. Look at this. Most annoying tentacle you could possibly ever find. Now then, in regards to this big fellow... I guess we're just gonna have to wait a while, because he's a big one. Well, let's just go ahead and get the rest of the stuff before we come back here. It's so boring. Uh, okay, there's some more items in here. I think that Stonefang is probably one of the most boring levels when it comes down to collecting stuff. Because there's just a lot of items to collect, and there's just a lot of uh, exploration and stuff like that. And I'm not sure if, you, if that's something that you guys really enjoy me doing, but it's the completionist in me would not allow me to do it any other way. And I guess it's back to beating on this guy for a while. How are you feeling? You kind of, uh, how's it hanging there? You're kind of almost falling down. You're probably not feeling so good, are you? Not feeling so hot right about now? It's fine. Here. There you go. How does that taste? Here's some more. It's just about wailing on the big fat guy. Oh my god. Just gonna keep on beating the crap out of you. What the hell is that noise? Does it actually start like making noises when it's about to explode? Oh no, wait, it's the bleeding. I've actually managed to bleed this guy. Well, let's get the hell out of Dodge then. Boom. Did it hit Patches? <laughs> hit Patches, how did that feel? You! How did you do that? Very carefully. That's how. You! Oh, you're just like, how did you, oh, how did you do that? Well, I wailed on it until it died. That's how, Patches. It's not that hard when you've got a set of balls instead of being a backstabbing scumbag like you. Shard of Dragonstone. Ring of Flame Resistance. Oh, Ring of Flame Resistance might actually be useful against uh, our buddy... Our buddy Flame Lurker, but not really going to use it because I just need the Clang Ring. Clang Ring is OP. 